Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. It's Bayern. They take on Leipzig and it's live on EA TV. Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you live action from the Bundesliga in a matter of moments. It is Bayern Munich, and they take on RB Leipzig. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. And so they start at 11 for Bayern. Manuel Neuer stands between the posts. Matthijs de Ligt plays with Dario Upamecano in central defence. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. And here's how Leipzig will line up. Well, it's the basic 4-4-2 formation, but played well, it can be really effective. And key to its success are the wide midfield players. They have to be fit, they need to be able to run with the ball, and they need to double up with their fullbacks. It's a really tough role for them. Contest begins. De Ligt. Alfonso Davies. Müller. Cancelo. Opportunity for Müller. Oh, a tremendous block. Played in by Kimi. Well cleared away. Cancelo. Now Kimi. And the snuffing out of the cross there. And cleared away. A corner kick it'll be. They take it short. Could be. And just over the bar. Excellent effort it was. Well, if the form book has its say, every reason to believe Thomas Müller will make a big impact here, Stuart. Well, he's such a natural finisher. He has everything a good goal scorer needs. Composure, technique and awareness. He will certainly need to be tight. Oh, they could be in here, Stuart. A smart stop here. Delivering it. Well, how on earth did Manuel Neuer get there? And there's the delivery. And he clears the danger. Moving the ball forward with purpose. But they took care of the situation defensively. And support available. Neymar. 
Interception to snuff out the danger. Thomas Müller. Davies. Now Kimmich. Just looking for the right moment for that final pass. Well, tremendous block. Schlager. Leimer on the ball. No possibilities in the centre. And a corner kick for the referee's verdict. Can someone get on the end of this? Not the best clearance. And Kunku. Must be. In it goes. The opening goal in this contest. Well, here's the replay. And you can see why the manager is furious. It's just really poor play. Offering up possession far too easily in a dangerous area. And at this level, if you keep doing that, you're going to get punished. It's just not good enough. And the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Andre Silva. Can they do something positive on the counter attack? Well, that's one for them to pursue. Well, such a high degree of difficulty, not quite in the end. Well, how good was that? It's such a difficult piece of skill, which he made look so easy. That deserved a goal. Joshua Kimmich. Alfonso Davies. Jamal Musiala. And Bayern Munich now in potentially a dangerous position. Firing it towards goal. Not a very complicated catch for the keeper. Andre Silva. Nkunku. Schlager. And a clear foul, but the referee letting the play flow. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Schlager. And the keeper able to hold on to it. Well, no stopping him. Now veering in field. Just made sure nothing came of that. Well, Leipzig just can't dominate the possession, but their attacking play has been really incisive. It's been a really good display from them so far. And offside, just as he was ready to pounce. Müller. Gives it a go. Well, it looked as though it had a chance of going in. Well, he should make the keeper work there, but you sense a goal is coming. So Bosloy. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. 
Joao Cancelo. Now with Müller. Well, it didn't happen for them in attack. So nearing the half-time interval and Bayern with a bit of work ahead of them. Stuart, keen as always to get your analysis as regards their first-half display. Well, it's been a fairly even first half so far, but they haven't shown enough creativity, particularly in midfield, where there's been too many negative passes. If they can get the ball into the front areas that little bit quicker, I think they'll get back into this. Didn't have to think about it too hard. Neuer. Thomas Müller. could be the equaliser but oh what an important save how about that well at least he hit the target but he should really beat the keeper from there they should be level now well, they fancy a short one firing it in and using his body to good effect A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. And the match begins. Well, the ball is moving again. It's advantage Leipzig after the first 45, but plenty of time for a few twists and turns before this one is over. An unforced error, you've got to say. Kimmich. Joao Cancelo. Müller. Real chance. And a goal to level it up. Well, it's great awareness of space in the box. And then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. So, a level contest. 1-1. Well, as you can see, he gave the keeper no chance there. He looked so confident, didn't he? That's a cool finish. Underway, they are again, and it's Bayern with the lead. It might be on for them. And since they have the ball, a referee playing advantage here. Well, no real accuracy and easy for the keeper. Joshua Kimmich. Leon Goretzka. Choupo-Moting. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. And that is how to block. Who can he pick out? Oh, great header. Smart stop, though. Corner again.
Now sending it in. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the chance. Raum. Nkunku. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. A foul, but advantage Bayern. Chupomotin. And blocked for now. Constantly thwarted. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. He successfully got past him. But no damage done, that's the main thing. Plenty of support here. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Very quick thinking there. Thomas Müller. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Nkunku. Determined defending. Lima. Oh, he fancies his chances. A gift for any goalkeeper. Alfonso Davies. Shupomoting. Well read to win possession back. He's taken on his opponent here. Joao Cancelo. And there to intervene. A free kick decision going the way of Bayern. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. He continues his run. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder, and it's a great finish. He holds off the defender, keeps his composure, and finds the back of the net. It's a marvellous goal. No shortage of goals in this match. 3-1. Chupomoting and running it back. Well, nearing the end of this contest, and Bayern in cruise control, Stuart. Well, they've controlled most of the game, haven't they? Their one and two touch passing has been sharp, the movement's been bright, and they've scored some good goals. They just need to keep their concentration through to the final whistle. Werner. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Shupomoting. Jamal Musiala. Joao Cancelo. And no nonsense defensive clearance. Just the challenge that was required. Five minutes left. Timo Werner. Now can they counter clinically? Well, it petered out. Alfonso Davies. Oh, a perfectly timed pass. And just has to remain calm. Oh, that's top notch goalkeeping, you've got to say.
What's he going to do here? Muda. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. So making the substitution now. Serge Gnabry moving forward effectively and so the referee blows for full time a satisfactory outcome for Bayern fans around the world what did you think of their performance as a whole? Well Derek, they were dominant in most aspects of the game particularly in that midfield area and they also looked threatening in the top third of the pitch it's a really good result for them A performance you've got to conclude that he'll be proud of I'm talking of course about Thomas Müller well, that performance sums him up, really. You're never disappointed with what he gives you. Such a good player.